channel, Stephanie again. So um, uh, so I have this um this mango here. I have some some pre cut mangoes. So I have four different things here that I'm gonna be trying the mangoes with, and then I'm gonna tell you guys what my favorite is. You can try this at home. It's not a lot. Um, so just to start, here's the mangoes. Um, these are green mangoes from I think they were going to Mexico, but the ones in the Philippines are yellow and are extremely sweet. I don't think you can compare Philippine mangoes anywhere else. Oh, we got these ones in Seafood City. You can barely ever find yellow mangoes. Um, so I have the different things here, and I have four different bowls. Here I have some, like I showed you before, the pre-cut mangoes. In the Philippines, mango is like, like, a, like, a, like a street food. Um, so you can just find mangoes just anywhere. Um, so this is Toyo, or for all my English viewers, this is sea, uh, this is soy sauce. Um, so this this one right here, this one soy sauce. So bowl number four is soy sauce. And then this one, this one is ba bagaong ista. So this one is in in other words, um, what it, it says on the bottle is this is just it's just um, fish extracts, water, and sea salt. So in other words, it's like like a fish sauce kind of. Um, this one is bagaong alamang. So this one is um, once again for English viewers, that is just shrimp paste. And then the last one, it did come from a bottle. This one is salt or um, I think it's a sin. I think. I can't exactly remember all of them. Um, so yeah, it's just salt. That's my mom showing you. There is salt in that bowl. So, um, anyways, I have, um, I'm going to try them one by one. Like I said at the beginning of the episode, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try them one by one with the, with the mango. And I'm going to tell you guys what my favorite one is. Like I said, you can try this at home. Um, once again, it's just salt, shrimp paste. It, you can use whatever sauce really but like, we're just using ones that we had in our pantry that my mom says she's pretty good with mangoes i'm kind of a selective eater i don't really like fish but i kind of like i kind of like some things um with with other things um so anyways i think i'm going to start with the salt um here we have first uh we have some like street food style um in the philippines street food is like on like sticks so my mom, she has, um, she cut one like, it. We just use like um like a skewer like for kebabs for grilling. It's just like half of a mango. It's just like half. You cut part of a mango off and you peel it. And you put it on the stick. Um, in the Philippines, this is five pesos or um or liman pesos, five pesos. So, um, just to start counting to five, isa dalawa tatlo apat. Lima. This is lima pesos. So once again, it is five pesos. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start with the salt here. Um, wow, I think it's really cool. The salt actually sticks to the mango because mangoes are just like juicy. So here's just the salt on the mango. Right here, I'm gonna try it. I could have put too much salt on that one. Pretty good. Hmm. I'm gonna say that the mango is pretty sweet and the salt adds like like just a like a jump of absolute flavor. I think it's pretty good with the uh, the mango. So um so that was bowl number one. Now I'm going to do bowl number two, which was the shrimp paste. Take one of the little strips here. I'm going to try with the uh, shrimp paste. Shrimp paste on. Hmm. 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 I'm going to say it is very good with the uh, with the mango it's okay it's a bit sour but it's okay like i said i'm kind of a selective eater this actually tastes kind of good 
Pretty good, guys. It's pretty good. So, that was, so, so far that was just, that was just, um, the salt and the shrimp paste. So, to all the viewers, kumusta po kayo? Um, for all the English viewers, that was just hello in Tagalog. Um, so yeah, that was just, once again, the salt and shrimp paste. They were pretty good. As I have said many times in this episode, I am a very selective eater. And I really, to be honest, I hate shrimp. And that was pretty good. Which is kind of saying something, because I don't really like shrimp. So now I'm going to do the, um, the soy sauce. I must say, mango is, it's a pretty interesting fruit. So now I'm going to try the soy sauce. Okay, let's see the soy sauce. Hmm. Well, once again, it's pretty good, but... Unlike the salt and the shrimp paste, the flavor is more of a lighter. The salt and the shrimp paste more had, or had more of a pop, and the um, this one was more like it was more like it started out slow, like 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 a firecracker. It started out slow, and then that's when all the flavor just kicked in. It was still really good. So so far, that was just salt, shrimp paste, and soy sauce. The last one here is um, once again it's like the uh, it's basically just like like fish sauce. So once again, here's the uh, the bottle. So it's just that. I'd say all these are pretty good. I can't say my favorite yet because I haven't tried the last one. Hmm. Hmm. That was pretty salty. <laughs> I'm gonna say that was not what I was expecting. <laughs> I'm sorry for making faces. That was not what I was expecting, guys. It was still, it was still actually really good. And really, the only fish I really like is sardines sometimes and tuna. So saying that I like these two is pretty interesting. And they are... Mm, it was really good. This one has a really strong aftertaste. <laughs> so, now I'm going to think again about which one I think my favorite is. So, just one last time. Salt, shrimp paste, soy sauce, and then this one is the fish. So, and it, back in Tagalog, this one is toyo. This one is asin. This one, um, this one is bagaong is that and this one is bagaong alamang or the shrimp paste i think i think i can't hmm i'm just gonna start by saying the salt wasn't my favorite and i'm probably gonna say that because i put way too much salt on when i tried it but it's not my favorite um the shrimp paste it was interesting it was pretty good it was actually really good but hmm I don't think that was my favorite. I think my favorite is a tie between these two. This one had a strong taste. This one had like a taste that got that started out small and got really big. So yeah, it was <laughs> the, my favorites, my two favorites. Just just to say, these are my two favorites. Once again, I'm gonna say I can't exactly say that this one was my favorite, probably because I put way too much salt, and I don't really like the taste of this one exactly. But these ones, these ones are pretty good. So, um, now I'm just going to try just the mango by itself. Hmm. Once again, not as sweet as mangoes from the Philippines. It's still, hmm. There's, it tastes like kind of like those candies where it starts out sweet and then it goes sour like a sour patch. It was sweet at the beginning and it got slightly sour at the end. It was actually very, very nice taste to these mangoes. Philippine mangoes are yellow to color, so you can always tell they're going to be super sweet. These ones aren't exactly, they're not exactly ripe. You know when a mango is ripe, 
when it is yellow. These mangoes aren't yellow on the outside. They're not going to be yellow. So these ones aren't exactly ripe. Philippine mangoes are always absolutely sweet, delicious, and ripe. This was a very interesting test. I actually really like doing tests like these. Um, though I am a selective eater, I do like trying new foods at times. So, um, yeah, that's really it, guys. I'm really grateful that you guys have been watching. Um, and in Tagalog, um, my... <laughs> um, mar Maraman Slamat po. God bless everyone for watching. Uh, for what? Thank God bless everyone, and thank you a lot for watching our videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and hit the bell notification button for more videos. Bye.